Hello everyone, Incredible John here. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to do some uh, Exo Rumination on uh, Mandala. So we should be able to kill a lot of people, I hope so. It's been a while since we've done some, Le some Legion of Angels uh, fighting, <laughs> so I'm quite excited for it. Hopefully you guys are too. If you are, hit that like button and we'll get right over to it. So, uh, also what the hell? And uh, never mind, I thought I thought there was something wrong with with me with my thing. There we go. I'm 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 fine now. I'll cut that out. Anyway, welcome back to another video. So we'll see how everything works. So it's going to be nice to kick people's ass. If you guys did not see the update video, he has Isha plus twenty five, he has Tia plus twenty five, he has Eureka plus twenty five, and Dora plus eleven. Yes, dragon stuff, dragon stuff, dragon stuff, Valorium sword, and dragon stuff. And his Isha, she is quite, she's quite powerful. He's over 50 billion bath rating. So we should be able to do a very good job right here. So Tempty is riding a new mount, and we'll kill her for it because I want that mount. And when I can't have something, I have to make myself feel better by killing the peep, the person with a stronger account than my own because I would have lost. <laughs> I would have lost instantaneously, and that's not even a lie. I would have I'm 3 billion bat rating, like that would. I would not stand a chance. So let's take a look at how how we do. Mandala, according to bat rating stats, he should be able to make it. I assume we'll see, and uh, he's already kicking ass, to be honest. He's rage killing, one shotting everyone. Like, everyone's just dying right here, and the Eureka's double rage killing, just kicking everyone's ass. Eureka was immune though, okay. And let's see here. Uh, so, Madala's Dora is a bit low, but he, she's not his focus anyways, it's, it's whatever. Like, his important heroes is very well and alive. And he even did heal his Dora up to almost full. So, Tempty. 600 million hit. Was that 600 million? Well, whatever it, I think it was 600 million. But yeah, he don't, the, the enemy don't stand a chance. Madala did stop recharging again, so that's why he doesn't have a lot of Valorium equipment. And he doesn't have the new hero, Sylvia or whatever, so he doesn't have any of that. Sylva the Scorner, I believe the name is, because they didn't make a video on her. Which you can also take a look at if, if you want my opinion on her. Uh, then I have a video for that as well, I'll see if I remember. To link it down in the description down below, I may. So Mandela starting off with a lot of rage already. The enemies doesn't seem to have like a rage start reduction type of dealio from from like from their divine uh, soul for, from their freaking um, what do you call it? What do you call it? This thing. This thing. Divine Edge system? Divine Edge system, yes. Yes. I'm mixing up with, I was going to say Divina Arma, but that's from Digi Avengers 3. That game was not released yet, so I would have been wrong. Also, just FYI, if you don't have eyes and you only have airs, what is currently taking place is Mandela kicking ass. So there we go. He is kicking enemies' ass and they're not standing a chance. Like they have no chance whatsoever. Mandala is damn good for his bath rating, but then again, we haven't fought anyone his own bath rating yet. So we don't really know until we have seen him um, fight someone his own bath rating. So we'll just have to wait until his battle pet really hurts the back row like nothing. So I assume, okay, the Tia is dead. Is she dead for the final time? I assume so. The front row is dodging. He, Mandala does have a good dodge. Eureka is dead, and her, on her last life, Mandela is a full-on healer with his uh, amazing-looking equipment. He's looking nice. And the Eureka should kill both of them. Isha is in her last lifeline, and she's barely hurting Mandela at all. The baby flipper, though, is hurting the Isha a little bit. I feel if he had a few more rounds left, I think, and the Isha wouldn't, and the Isha didn't have any healing or whatever. I think maybe the Isha could have died. Potentially, but not not necessarily much at all. Street is, the, is, is still paying somehow? Why is he still paying? What is wrong with... No. El Cito, I'll fight. These thing, these people... Ultra Mayhem is even paying? That guy, I remember him from such a long time ago. He's a cool guy, man. He's a cool guy. Yeah, hello, Ultra Mayhem. If you're watching this, hello. Hello to you, sir. 
Hope you have a good day. Okay, so Manella should be able to kill this. It's 20 billion bath rating higher. So it's a very easy victory. It should be a very easy victory. So I suppose we'll see. So Elcito has said for the first time Isha is on her last life already. Her intrepids did not trigger for some reason. That's weird. That's just super bad luck. That is an incredibly bad luck. So the Isha currently is taking a lot of damage. At uh, the back just the Eureka is kicking so much ass. It's like kicking ass. Re oh man, the Eureka is kicking Nadala's ass too a bit. Dora and Isha had it for the first time. That was unexpected. Uh, Reddit slash unexpected or something. Eureka is still alive. She does have one more life after this. Most likely, I would be very surprised if she doesn't have a life after this. But she should, she should have. I'll be damn surprised if not. Lumbering swing or whatever? Yeah, yeah. Is she really going to die for the last time? No, but she is damn close. If that's double damage thing triggered, I think... I think uh, Mandala's Isha would be bye-bye. I think we could just say goodbye to her or something. Well, Eureka is stunned and she has no way of unstunning herself at the moment, I don't think. And the Solarm dealt 270 million. How did a Solarm deal that much damage? I have no idea. Anyway, let's uh, kill this street person. Yeah, he's... I I have videos of him when I, he was 400 million bat rating and I killed him. Uh, I don't think it'll from. I don't think it will be a fun battle, so I'll just skip it. Yeah, C zero. It would not have been too entertaining. Uh, Titmus still paying. I wanna fight uh, Titmus and Loto is damn good for his bath rating, so we may give him a shot too. So Sen River from my from my own server. I remember when. Like, Sen River didn't play when I was in the server at, at, at the beginning, like, they, they joined later and then they obviously paid when it was a good time to pay. Here I am with 13, 3 point something billion bat rating, 3.8, it's like nothing, it's like nothing in comparison to what a whip 13 would be right now, I wasted so much money. <laughs> that is basically what I'm going to say, I wasted so much money, I don't recommend paying much in these games to be honest, it's not really the most fun, it is fun. But it's damn addicting, and it's not really worth it. It's not. It's not worth it. The cost. It's fun, but like, you have so much better games to spend your money on if you're considering spending on games, like League of Legends too. Like, like let's say let's say you see a pit. It's like it's like the pit in in the in the movie It. It's like a pit in It, and the, it goes down infinitely. It goes down literally infinitely. And that's basically what this, this game is. You throw a coin in, the game is like, okay, we won't... Let stronger players beat... Okay, by the way, Mandela's having troubles. We won't let stronger players beat you too easily. And uh, when you stop paying, they just come up out, out of that pit and they're like, ha, we're going to kill you right now. And then you're stuck there and you have to pay more to, to, to be among the top. And I... That's not... It's a genius way for GTRK to make money. And it's even a... It is... It's a nice way to make money for them. It's just very unfortunate for players because... There's always going to be someone who pays. Like, for example, if you're... If you're um, in a big airport, right? And you've been working at that airport for maybe... Maybe like a year or something. You're guaranteed, you're guaranteed going to face some very, very freaking rich people. And they can throw a thousand dollars to the game like, yeah, that's nothing to me. While you're there among the others who's most likely not rich, sitting there like, okay, I'll, I'll use a good majority of my wealth. Or, or whatever, whatever your worth is. Or whatever, whatever you have to your name basically and you're like, you can't, you can never spend as much as them and then it makes it kind of useless. <laughs> Anyway, sorry about that rendition. We did beat the person. Um, Mandela barely takes any damage from that Eureka. That Eureka freaking sucks. That's a horrible Eureka. That Eureka could just kill. That's a nice um, divine edge though. That's a that's a nice looking thing. This is definitely a player who has that finished already. That's amazing. Nice job. Anywho, the TS on her last life. Isha is dead for the first time. Uh, Dora will rage kill, Tia will also rage kill, and 
you are out of damage, the Isha is still alive. Yurik will kill the Isha. The Isha is in our last lifeline. The Isha is almost killing Mandala, holy crap. Yeah, this guy, he needs to heal up again. Yeah, go on, heal up with Eye of Wonders. Yeah, there we go, he's fully healed up again, almost, except for his Eureka. She has a lot of HP, but she can't be healed by like 500 million or something, that's amazing. 1.3 billion, 1.3 billion, 1.1 billion, 800 million, and 800 million HP, 837 million, it's still a lot. Still a lot is what I'm trying to say. 1.5 billion damage, kicking the Eureka's butt. Also, I love that soul arm. No, no, that, that card. That card looks amazing. I love that figure. It's it's sick. I love it. Like, that's an amazing looking uh, thing. Tempty, no Anuka. Sadly, no. I'm not going to fight you. Sadly not. I'm, I want to fight some higher, higher bath ratings. I'll, I'll obviously fight you, but I'll not do the manual fight because I want fun. I want fun battles. That's what I want. I want some damn fun battles and I'm going to deliver. Uh, so now we're against Loto. He's always been good for his bath rating. He's always been very good. Uh, as you can see, his Isha did tank <laughs> barely. Uh, well, his he's he's not good against someone 20 billion bath rating higher than him. No one is normally good except for maybe Moresha. He's usually good no matter what. <laughs> you can be 50 billion bath rating higher than him, and he can find a strategy to beat you. He's a very clever guy, this Moresha. Moresha, Moresha. This is not Moresha. Why did I say this Moresha? Moresha. You guys remember him? He is also on some videos of mine. If you have seen them, of course. If you you can just search Moresha on my channel or see through some grand tournament videos, because I'm sure he's in the earlier ones. He doesn't really. I don't think he pays anymore or even plays very actively because I've I have not seen that guy in forever. He's not in my. I've not. He's not in my Discord. I haven't seen him. Anywhere in a very, very, very long time. Lydia will respawn for the first time. She's just super tanky. She's like everything since I played has just multiplied by 10 or 20 or even freaking 100. Okay, I don't think 100. Well, no. I don't, nothing has multiplied by 100 since I've played. Nothing. But it, it's getting there, you know? Like I had, well, I have 100 million HP. They have maybe 14, 15, okay, up to 20 times what my HP is. And the attack is up to 10 times. And the agility is up to 5 times. So yeah, there's nowhere near 100, per 100 times increase. But it's, it's, it's increasing every day. Every new system, every new thing, it's increasing. Temptive, oh yeah, well, we have to, we have to kill. I love that mount, man, that looks amazing. I love that look. That look right there, it's nice. This new mount too. I've not covered new things in a while, so most of these things can be new. I still, just said the same batch of enemies. Does the game have no creativity? Creativity? Please give me some creativity. Sand River is actually good. Also, Titmus did manage to kill Mandala. Nice. His main character, not, not the rest of him. Are you crazy? Titmus also was usually very good for their building, but... Like, the best one I knew of in my server was Sefi, but he doesn't play anymore. Uh, Mikor, yes. Someone higher battle rating. Mikor? Sorry for being harsh, but Mikor normally does suck. He normally sucks a lot. He normally does suck. So let's hope that he doesn't suck. But what's his, bat what's his stats at? Well, he, he does... Hmm. It could be fun. It could be a fun battle. Also, my dial is just... Infinite stuff. So, let's let's fight Mikor. Let's see how it how we do. I hope that we'll find someone else also. But Mikor, from my experience... <coughs> I beat him back in the day. He obviously beat me because he, he has a bigger wallet than I do. Or rather, he, he's not Richard Bent. But even then, I don't think I would have paid that much. It's not really fun anymore to pay for me, but that's just that's just me. Like, I'm very interested in seeing people paying. It's good for them, but I'm like, I did that and I don't want to do it anymore. And I'm like, it just feels weird to me to see people like asking me, "Hey, what should I spend on?" And I'm like, I haven't recharged since the beginning of August last year. How the fork should I know? what you should recharge on. I'm very flattered that you're asking me, hey, 
what should I recharge on? But I'm really advising you to join my Discord and actually asking people who do recharge. Dmark, for example, he recharges, he's a genius, he knows everything, he knows exactly what event you want to recharge on. Snowder also knows exactly what event you want to recharge on. There's many, many very, very experienced players in this game who does recharge. I'm not one of the rechargers anymore, so I can't really tell you, hey, you should try this event. I obviously can tell you, like, you're R13, you need blessing stones. 1 plus 1 equals 2. You you go for blessing stones if they're available in an event. That, for example, is a good thing, and you usually get a lot of those during Tycoon. Unless they changed it, which they may have. Also, if you need origin power, go, go for it, or primal crystals. You recharge for what you need to improve your main hitter, because you do need to be a one hero focus. That is the best strategy you can be, unless you have five times, you, unless you have a bigger wallet, basically. If you have money to build everyone super high, then by all means go for it, but it's thousands, tens of thousands of dollars probably, so I always suggest focusing a lot on one hero and making the rest of your team support that hero, and that's normally the best way. Also, Mikor did die quite easily. So that's just an FYI for everyone who, who is like, okay, what should I recharge on? Ask someone else! <laughs> or just just do as I, I say right now, focus on what you need. Like, focus on the resources you require and or need, so there we go. Yeah, let's open up that, let's also open up that. Send river, uh, nope. Uh, well, well, we'll do five more ch attempts. Hopefully Mandela won't be upset mm -hmm. with me that I'm doing this. Uh, so, yeah. Yeah, because I didn't ask him to dog, I didn't ask him to do this. He may not have wanted to attend, so hopefully he did not... Hopefully he just forgot about it. I sure hope so. I hope he can forgive me if not. I hope he can forgive me. But anyway, it's, it's free reward, so I don't really understand why. Oh, well that, that was it, and there is no new enemies I assume. I don't think we'll face any stronger enemies, unfortunately that's very sad. Oh freaking well. Okay well I don't, don't miss will be gone. Well I would like to thank everyone for watching this video, if you did enjoy it, hit that like button and subscribe. To Incredible John, and I messed up with my thing. I'm trying to change all my links to Incredible John. We're not that anyone to train anymore. We're Incredible John, and we'll stay that way forever, maybe forever. I think so. Like, what's the point in changing right now, eh? It's fine, right? Hopefully, hopefully, is it fine? Let me know. <laughs> anyway, have a good one, guys, and uh, goodbye.